Today I would like to talk about one of the most important ritual objects used in Taoism. It's called the Five Thunder Block, and with it, it's uh, a, a similar uh, thunder symbol, the Vajra, which is used in, by Buddhists in Tibet. So the Vajra in Tibet summons thunder and lightning to purify us, and a date wood block, very old in Taoism, is used to purify us and to bring uh, awareness of transcendent Tao presence, or in the Buddhist case, the transcendent, into our feelings, into our total bodily awareness. First, I'm going to talk about the five thunder block. First, it's so important in Taoism. All Zheng Yi Taoists, all Orthodox Taoists from Lu Hu Shan, which is Southeast China, Gazao Shan in uh, West China, Mao Shan, right near Nanjing, and the Beijing Baiyun Guan, all the Taoists use this to pray with. And it has two uses. One, it can be used to print. So if you come and want me to make a talisman you can put in your house, then we can put red paint on this and print your talisman with it. And you can bring it home and put it in your house. So thunder and lightning, the spirit of thunder and lightning, especially lightning, keeps all demons and all angry thoughts out of your house and fills you with love. And the um, written on it is five thunder summoning the five thunder spirit commands blessing to our house it's truly a beautiful symbol uh, i do treasure this i have two of them on the other side of it uh, it um, su su suggests that when thunder is seen in the mountains then all of us are purified the uh, crops are purified, the winds are purified, and then it has seven left and right. All sides of the universe are purified. So we keep this, and what the Taoist does with it, he actually draws talismans in the air with it, and then he puts it down, and then he uses the mudra, and please look, this is my right hand, thumbs and thin fingers extended, I take my right hand and join my two fingers, then I pull it back and touch my thumbs, and then I pull it into my heart. And doing that, I ask the five thunders to enter my heart and purify me so that I can stand in transcendent presence and pray. The very same idea is used by the Tibetan monks, but they don't use a date wood block they use what they call a Vajra, a Vajra meaning a thunder and lightning symbol. And the same as this is used by Taoists, this is used by Tibetan monks, which they pray with and draw talismans in the air. So you'll find this in all monasteries, and it was given to me by a wonderful Tibetan monk who gave it as a, something to protect me in all my beautiful wonderful uh, journeys to uh, Tibet itself, which is such a wonderful place to visit. Thank you so much for listening. I have a today. question, Professor Sasso. Yes. Is the Vajra sometimes referred to as a Dorche in Tibet? I feel like it was called the Dorche before. Yes, uh, it's that, called Dorje. In Tibetan, is that yes, the difference? Yes, they use the word Dorje. And then Vajra would be the Sanskrit? Vajra is the Sanskrit, yes, yes. Dorje. Thank you. Thank you for the clarification. Thank you for the question.